Hi, my name is Waldemar and I'm a software developer at Harkon. Our team has built a new product that allows you to travel back in time, our Hafas time machine. Because of the European passenger rights, transport companies are facing challenges on compensation claims. Right now, it's complicated and time-consuming to check the claims. With the Hafas time machine, we make this process as simple as possible. We help transport companies in finding out whether a specific journey was possible as scheduled. You can check the historical real-time data and the system indicates if the connection was writable or disrupted. It's possible to review every day of last year. So, let's have a look at the application. There are two ways to access the Harfas time machine. One is our web interface. The other option is an API that allows you to integrate it into your existing applications. What you see here is the web interface. You can access the servers for the travel days you want to check. Let's assume that there are three compensation claims we have to check. All three journeys took place on the 6th of July. This might look familiar. What you see here is based on our web app where passengers would do their trip planning. Our first imaginary traveler has booked a trip from Oldenburg to Hamburg. He started in Oldenburg at 7.35 p.m. and claimed a significant delay on arrival. So let's take a look at the whole travel chain. Yes, indeed, there was a delay. However, the trip is classified as definitely rideable as the connection has a delay of only 17 minutes on arrival. To be on the safe side, Let's take a closer look. The first train arrived in Bremen on time, so problems with the changeover can be ruled out. The second train left 21 minutes late, but actually arrived only 17 minutes late. The passenger's claim can be rejected because the delay on arrival was less than 60 minutes. Our second passenger wanted to travel from Cologne to Kiel. Departure was scheduled at 4.09 pm, arrival at 9.32 pm. As we can see here, the trip was not rideable as planned. This was because the ICE from Cologne to Hamburg was cancelled. However, there was a definitely rideable alternative. This one might be an option, for example, with a delay on arrival of only 8 minutes. The customer's claim can be rejected here as well. In the last case, someone wanted to travel from Ruland to Dresden in the evening. Unfortunately, this connection was not rideable and the next rideable connection is on the following day. So in this particular case, the passenger's claim would be justified. That was a quick overview. We are convinced that our product will be useful for you. If you have any questions, feel free to get in touch with us. And the system indicates if the connection was rideable or disrupted. It's possible to review every day of the last year. Es wird durcheinander gebracht.